After nearly three decades, UCF President Dr. John Hitt will be retiring. Today, Dr. Hitt participated in his last official function as the university's president. New 6's Amanda Castro was there. It was a huge send off for Dr. Hitt as he wrapped up his last official function as UCF's president. He choked up saying he's looking forward to retirement and knows UCF will charge on into the future. It's a farewell more than 25 years in the making. UCF president Dr. John C. Hitt surrounded by supporters and students, many carrying signs thanking him for his decades of service. I want to thank you from the bottom of my heart for being a mentor that I could emulate. Hitt finished his long career at UCF by addressing the State Board of Governors for one final time this morning. He reflected on his accomplishments during his tenure, remembering the first speech he ever gave as president and the goals he set for the university. I said that a university achieves true greatness through a combination of vision, planning, hard work, vital support, and good luck. These qualities and the people who have so ably embodied them have transformed our university. During its time, UCF grew into one of the largest universities in the nation with more than 66,000 students, opened a medical school, and started plans to build a downtown Orlando campus. But Hitt didn't want to focus too much on what he's done. Instead, focusing on UCF's future under President-elect Dr. Dale Whitaker's leadership. As I look to the future, I know that, the, that our most daring days are ahead of us that our students and faculty will inspire the world and that uh, you will be there every step of the way. Leaving campus with one final message. At UCF, we dream big. Our greatest limitations are those we place on ourselves. Let's all keep reaching for the stars. Go Knights. In Orange County, Amanda Castro, News 6.